How's it going guys? And welcome back to another JHR review. Today I'm going to be showing you how I turned this scrap wood and some glass and a little bit of wooden dowels into a Star Wars hologram machine. And basically, as you can see right here, I screwed the dowels into the side, notched out the wood at an angle so that this could set down at the specific kind of spot, and then I put some tape on the top so it didn't ruin my phone screen. And then I just kind of rounded off the edges. But if we move this over here and grab my phone, I can grab that message from Princess Leia to Obi-Wan Kenobi. And if we start it up, all right, so I made a little bit of a cut and I turned my lights off because I want to show you guys what it looks like in the dark first. So if we get that message from Princess Leia and we click play, we can position it on here. Years ago, you served my father in the Clone Wars. Now he begs you to help him in his struggle against the Empire. I regret that I am unable to present my father's request to you in person, but my ship has fallen under attack and I'm afraid my mission to bring you to Alderaan is failed. I have placed information vital to the survival of the Rebellion into the memory systems of the SAR-2 unit. My father will know how to retrieve it. You must see this droid safely delivered to him on Alderaan. This is our most desperate hour. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only help. How cool is that? Now let's go ahead and turn the lights on and see what we can get. All right, and now let's do one with the lights on. So let's repeat the message. Set it down. Right there. Now he begs you to help him in his struggle against the Empire. I regret that I am unable to present my father's request to you in person, but my ship has fallen under attack, and I'm afraid my you can also adjust it. I have placed information vital to the survival of the rebellion into the memory systems of the SAR-2 unit. My father will know how to retrieve it. You can see my fingers through her. How cool is that? That is such a unique, like, kind of little, like, optical illusion. And, uh, yeah. This was really fun to make, and it took me a while to figure out what kind of design that I wanted to do, and how I would get the phone to set up there properly. But, uh, after I figured out the little notch technique and these little dowels that I found, I think this was actually a really successful little project, and I hope you guys like it. And, uh, if you guys enjoyed, please, please, please feel free to share this with your friends and get it out there and show people that they can create really cool things with just a little bit of scraps laying around, especially when we're all mostly stuck inside right now. But yeah, a huge shout out to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your support. You guys are awesome. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. I have my Patreon in the description below. Uh, times are a little tough right now, so I'm pushing that a little bit more than I normally would. You guys aren't obligated to, but if you want to check out my tiers, I have many of them from $1 all the way up to about 500 But there's anything in between, and all of it helps. And as always, I'll see you in the next video.